In this video, I'll be giving you all my experience with the Speedgen Rugged Armor Google Pixel 2 case. So let's go ahead and get right into it. If any of you watched my Google Pixel 2 review, you'll know that I unfortunately did not use a case the first month with this phone, and it resulted in some light scratches on the front of the display. So I'm using this Speedgen case not only to fix this problem, but also just to keep my phone protected in general. The case is made of a rubbery TPU material, which does make taking it on and off very easy. At the top and bottom of the back of the case is a carbon fiber textured material, which gives it a classier look than a completely rubber case. The Speedgen case is also pretty thin and doesn't add much heft or weight to the phone either. As you can see here, the cutouts for the USB-C port is well made, the power buttons and volume markers are both covered, but they're still very tactile and responsive. On the back of the case is a cutout for the fingerprint sensor, and one nice added touch is that the sensor is still easily accessible, and the cutout actually slopes down into the sensor for ease of use. On the front of the phone, you can see that the case protrudes just enough over the screen to give an added layer of protection, should you place your phone on the table face down. And it's likely that putting my phone face down is why the screen on my Pixel 2 is scratched, so it's nice to see this feature here. Anyway, Speedgen is always one of the better phone case brands. They've been around a long time, and this is actually their cheapest case which I did purchase here, and I'm really happy with this decision. I don't think you can go wrong with the Speedgen case for only $11. So again, if you want to pick one up, go ahead and check out the link in the description. Give this video a thumbs up, and I'll see you all in the next video.